Good morning, Swatika. Arun Swatika. So uh, we're heading to the dentist later today and I'm hoping he's going to be open. We asked and the, the neighbors said that he would be open, but the dentists here, it's quite interesting. They work in the hospitals during the day and uh, that's where Thai people can come and get like free dental care. Right, dear? Am I right? Okay. Yeah. yeah, but it takes a long time. So these same dentists mm -hmm. will then after five o'clock when they're done at the hospital will go and they'll have a private clinic and uh, so you get most of your dental work done here as a foreigner probably after five or six at night but these guys work hard i mean they're working 12 13 hour days every day so but let's see uh because i broke the tooth off right at my gum line so the root and the bottom part of the tooth is still there so it's going to be like a full extraction and uh and I don't know what options they have as far as, um, you know, if they screw in a new tooth or I, I don't know what they do. So pull them all out. Pull them all out. <laughs> so you can see over here the uh, smoke from the uh, burning the, the rice is uh, practicing social distancing, staying nice, nice, <laughs> nice, nicely apart, nicely spaced smoke. The new normal, right, dear? Yes. <laughs> we witnessed it yesterday. It's just, I hate it. Oh my God. They, uh, we, we went into uh, Thai Watsudu, like the Home Depot here yesterday. And man, are they strict in there. Just like most places, I guess. They're, uh, yeah, they take your temperature when you go in. Uh, they have marks on the floor. You have to, you can't come within certain distances of people. Uh, you have to sign in. Uh, you have to walk in there to show the germ to them. Oh yeah, yeah, they have little yeah. things you walk through, uh, a little pad that you have to walk through and uh, make sure you got no corona on your on your tootsies. Yeah, that is uh, like, I think they got up there, turn air conditioning on. Yeah. You have to kill the germ first before you walk. You got to put the alcohol on your hands. Yeah. That's like, you got to wear a mask in there the whole time. And, and somebody just there hasn't been a case here in going on there hasn't been a case here in going on three months that's why it really does it annoys me <laughs> the new normal can go stuff itself ah, because this the uh, road crew yesterday came through here and and you see they've cleaned it all up because these roads just grow in uh if you don't do something about it this road will disappear <laughs> By the end of rainy season, it'll be covered. They do a good job down yet today, no? Yeah, they did yeah, a great job. Sweep everywhere. Yeah, swept yeah. it all off. We uh, we were on the hunt for dentists, so we didn't help, but uh, we did make a little donation to. Uh, would you give them here a couple hundred baht or something, right? To... No, this time I give them hundred baht. Hundred baht. That's enough to cover eyes and the water and things like that. Right, yeah, yeah. They didn't have to feed them or anything, but we just made a donation towards the keeping them cool yeah. and refreshed. So I just rode my bike up here to the cigarette bridge. And uh, just an update on this big reservoir they're putting in. It's about a dozen guys working here. So we'll have a little look here at Uncle Pat's progress that he's doing here on his little house. Um, I guess his son-in-law and him are the ones doing the bulk of the work and the son-in-law has to go tend his fields. So they're going to get the roof on and then it's going to stop for a while. But yeah, he's got the, getting the, uh, he's not even, is he going to put glass in those too or what? Just a wooden cover that he opens. Do you know, dear? I have no idea. <clears throat> the windows. Uh, yeah. He might want some kind of. Oh, they're not back the toilet. <clears throat> oh, they're supposed the to dig a toilet? Yeah. yeah no, not yet, it's 
get a little slow going now. Just two of them over here, I think, or three of them. I can leave that must be the bedroom for us. That's the bedroom here. You think this is the bedroom? Yeah. This is going to be a kitchen? I would think so. And then the living room. Well, this would be perfect for Glenny's little shack house. Yeah. No? Like size like that? Not bad, eh? No, it's not. And this was uh, 80,000, I think you said. I No, 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 no. I don't know yet. I oh, you haven't, yet. you haven't got I a total. I don't think it will cost a lot, darling, because they don't have to pay for the labor. Right, no Some labor. That, that's just pretty much material. Yeah. The, the land's already owned. Mm -hmm. Not too bad, huh? Yeah, no, it's going to be good when it's all done. It's going to be, you know, a nice high ceiling and stuff too. So this could be a blueprint of, uh, you know, Glenny Shack House in the field. Yeah, we'll see. Nice. That's probably a window for the bedroom. Yeah, a couple of windows. Yeah. This will be the door. Be a door right here. Yeah, front entrance. Very good. So let's go over and look at the 10 rye. So this is how we access out to this 10 rye. To go through a mushroom farm. Oh, out here? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, so there's the uh, just relevant. You have to go around through the mushroom house if you come from the village. So, uh, but there's another back road in here from the back way. And this is. Uh, this is she gonna try to cross the beaver dam okay. there? I don't know. Maybe go that way. That way it looks easier. Yeah, let's just stand here and show me. Are we at your land now? This from here. Right here. This somebody out this side out. I see. To so all this. the way to the end. Really? That it don't tractor and oh, then the to the end way out over there. there look, to the corn. That what our shack count. And right to here? Like all the water, where all the water is. Huh. Correct? Huh? I said all the, your land yes, is yes. this from this corner. From this corner to that corner. Where all the water, all yeah, the water, and yeah, right out there. All and out past the, the tractor. Yeah. That's uh, Tone's tractor Very out there. Very long way. That's 10 rye. They have road on the way to the liver. You look at Oh, it I see. Is it yeah. the same road that goes past yeah, the yeah, other one? Yeah. The same road that goes past the three sorry, rye. Sorry. Okay. Sorry. That's the eucalyptus trees over there. For reference okay, point, you want to go? Yeah, you okay? Okay, yeah, watch for cobras. Man, the grass is long. Oh, you're brave. That is my life, people. <laughs> you just hope you don't step on one, that's all. Yeah, I die. Ah, darling. Yeah. Oh, she found a bridge. Ah. Just a little bit further. So the other three is just past that smoke out there. Where? That's the uh, the charcoal guy who makes the charcoal. Call it. Yeah. You see that you are drinking over there last night. That won't check out right. over there. Yeah. Okay. I like that. I like the three rye better. More <laughs> private. I don't want to be around all these kids. <laughs> eh? Too close. Too close for the kid to yeah. come, right? But not as far to stagger home from. They have the road over there. You want to walk? No, we don't need to walk way down to the end. Yeah. I can. We can see from here. Yeah. This is train and that's the same train road that runs right here. back up and goes right back out to the the main river. Look before in here they have a small uh, a pot like that. Don't just remove everything. Oh yeah. 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 Oh no, that's good. A lot easier. You get a yeah. lot of rice off of this land yeah. every year, two times a year. 
Oh, those clouds, they look kind of cool, eh? So the same for this steer? You paid 7,000 baht per oh, rye for this? 25 years ago. 25 years ago, yeah. 70,000 baht, maybe just, uh, what's that? 70,000 baht would be four grand, somewhere around there, maybe. Less than. Wow, I Should have brought some beer. Yeah. Oh, it just break the place. Oh, and it, you, so it can close down. Yeah. Close down like if it's raining hard or something. See it? Huh? See it? Nice little shack. <laughs> so the 10 rye is, the 10 rye is pretty good. Like it's nice and big, but a little harder to get to. <laughs> Closer if you're walking Sorry, I'm trying to go across the mud dam here. <laughs> it's close if you're walking. It's like a five minute walk from the house, but you, uh, if you want to bring anything or, you know, I'm thinking like coolers of Leo and stuff, you know, <laughs> I want to drive, be able to drive. Oh, no. You went the wrong one. Yeah. Nowhere to cross here? No. We go back. <laughs> We're going back. I think so. This is the one we came across. So yeah, what we'd have to do, drive up the road along along the river and then come in the same road but it's even further and uh, more bumpy to get back into here and to be up there beautiful view of the uh, of the mountain and stuff I'm going with the three rye as my choice nice house for rent right there anybody's looking yeah it is nice isn't it really kept in good shape and just sitting empty. If you had to guess, what would a house like that rent for? Like, say a Thai person wanted to rent that house, what would they? I would say outside, long way like that, maybe 2,500, 3,000. Really? Eh? More 3, expensive. Yeah. 2,000 would be maximum. Just because it's out here in the if, middle. Yeah, if I have to rent. Yeah. yeah. But they're nice and peaceful. Yeah, all oh, beautiful. Or the spot. night road, you know? Yeah, yeah, no, it's good. Only 15 minutes from here to Pan. Yeah. And you can get anything in pan, right? Yeah, no? yeah. Yeah. Then anything, you yeah, know. Yeah, got everything yeah. there. Grocery stores, yeah. works. Quite a few 7-Eleven in pan here. Yeah. At least three or four, right up? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, pan's great little city. Many I say the only thing they don't store. really have is, uh, you know, a mall or shopping center. No big oh, no, C's yeah. or, you know, no movie theaters or that kind of stuff. If you're into that, no real bar scene. No. But uh, <clears throat> if you're not into that stuff, Pan's a great little town. We like our peaceful life. Peaceful life, thank you. So the big boss is just checking me in. We came yesterday, there was about 20 people sitting where she is right now, out front. There's no way we were getting in. And uh, so she made me an appointment for today. So apparently they're opening up at four o'clock and I'm going in and I'll keep you guys updated see what happens uh, yeah so we just got back from the dentist finally got in after three attempts and uh, he gave me two options I have uh, option number one is to get a uh, what do you call it a crown mold crown, crown, yeah. not crown molding yeah. <laughs> oh hold on okay. So I have two options. One is a, a root canal with a crown. Uh, he said it takes about two months. I guess they got to build it. I don't know. I've never had one. First time I've ever broken a tooth off like this. Uh, that is, what did he say? 15,000 baht? 
Yes. It's probably around 700 oh. Canadian. And then option number two was a uh, dental implant. For that, I have to go up to Chiang Rai. And uh, he said that's around 50,000 baht. And that's around uh, hmm, 50,000 baht is probably around close to three grand, eh? Two, two to three grand. That's a lot of money. I have no idea. No, so. two and a half. Two and a half thousand? Yeah, less than three. Though. Yeah. Yeah, three would be 66. This yeah. around 66. So, yeah, two would be 44. So, a little bit more than 2,000. But, anyway, so he can't do either because we don't know when I'm going back. I'm probably going back within a couple weeks to Canada. So, uh, I need a couple months steady through here. So, he said it's it's fine. There's no pain. Uh, not likely to get infected. Just no fun to chew on. Uh, but uh, so I'm just gonna leave it, I guess, and uh, have it looked at when I get back. Make a decision if I get the implant or get the root canal. I'll just maybe spend the spend the big bucks and get an implant done. If they're, uh... anyways, maybe someone knows some guys in the comments, people who've had root canals, dental implants. Let me know which one, because I have no idea. And uh, so if you've got experience with in either of those, let me know what's going on. Because I somehow think the implant, just because it sounds like it's anchored in there permanently. And uh, Tick said that, uh, you know, previously they had problems with the crown, uh, with the root canals not holding together and stuff. So anyways, let me know what you guys think. So tonight's dinner, after our big walk through the rice field, quite hungry. Look at this, broccoli, cauliflower, lettuce, salad. Mm. Ham, everything. Ham yeah. in there, yeah. Some tomatoes, what are you eating over mm. here? What's this Thai, mm. oh, fuck tong? My. What is it? <laughs> fuck kill, fuck not kill. fuck you. Oh, yeah. Jesus, <laughs> <Sorry>. oh my <laughs> goodness. <laughs> fuck kill. Yeah. Um, some kind of um, Thai melon. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. With chicken, with the uh, grass noodle. Yeah. Some lemon leaf and the uh, cilantro. Okay, yeah. a nice Thai style dish. Eh? Right. This is lap mu. Another word means pork salad. Pork salad. Have all different kind of herb in there, like lemon grass, lemon leaf, and mint. Everything, darling. Mm, my all favorite. The spice. Yep. Aloy Mac. Aloy Mac. Thanks for watching, everybody. Come to enjoy with us and then so please follow us. We will have more interesting things for everybody to see. Thank you and appreciate that. If you like us, like our video, I'm so sorry about that. And then we come up for us. Yeah, subscribe. give us one of them. Give us one of them, guys. Thanks, everybody. Bye bye.